Hello dear students, now we are going to learn a very very simple concept that area under velocity time graph gives displacement. Okay, first what we will do, we will draw a velocity time graph. Okay, we take a velocity time graph. So what is velocity time graph? If you plot velocity along y axis and time along x axis, it is as if you are representing velocity as a function of time then we call it as velocity time graph okay now say a car okay is moving with some constant velocity u okay for some time t okay <clears throat> now what is the area under this curve this is the area now this is origin okay area under vt curve is equal to area under velocity time graph is equal to since it is like a rectangle it is length into breadth u into t area under velocity time graph is equal to u into t this is our uh, equation number one also we know that velocity is equal to displacement by time then what happens if you rearrange this equation displacement is equal to velocity into time I, I name this uh, equation as some equation number two then when you look at equation number one and equation number two okay I'll write from equation number one and two what do I get equation number one says that area is equal to u into t equation number two says that displacement is equal to u into t so therefore area under vt graph gives displacement therefore we can write that therefore area under vt graph area under vt graph gives displacement area under vt graph gives displacement why we have written like this from 1 and 1 and 2 what we can write area area is equal to displacement Correct now. Hope you understood this. Thank you very much.